Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Select a new pot and click OK. Select the required units and click OK. Select a plane which you want to sketch and you have to draw your circles. Then you have to give the dimensions based upon your requirement. Select a line command and draw the key bay. Then you have to use a delete segment. So select a delete segment and trim the unwanted lines. And click OK. Now you have to use the extrude option and give the amount of thickness to be produced. Click OK. Then you have to select a mid plane and draw a spline option so you have to draw a spline which defines the path of helical gear after drawing a helical profile and then click ok then use a swipe option before that we have project the curve on the outer surface so select a curve and use the project option just click our outer surface now our curve is projected on outer surface so use a swipe option, select a curve and click the edit swipe section. Draw the profile of gear teeth. So select a line and draw the profile. Then you have to use a three point arc which connect the ends of the lines and then click OK now our cut is created just extend the end parts by dragging them click the edit or uh, remove material and then click OK now our helical gear cut is created then we have to use a pattern command before that hide the unwanted planes just click the curve right click on it hide it then we have to use a pattern option select a axis based pattern and select a center axis as a reference enter the number of gear teeth to be produced and give the angular spacing between them 360 divided by 20 or 15 and then click ok now our gate teeth is created we have to increase the more number of teeth so just we have edit the pattern enter the number of gear teeth as a 20 and then give the angular spacing 360 divided by 20 and then click ok now we are increasing the number of gear teeth Now we need to draw the profile of uh, slots on the surfaces so select a sketch and then you have using a palette option to create a predefined shapes click on the shapes and uh, use a or crack track you have to rotate the or crack track concentrically to our outer circle Then you have to increase the size based upon your requirement. Then click OK. Then we have to use the extrude option. Change the flip direction and remove the material. Click OK. Then we have use a pattern option. Click the axis based pattern. Select our axis as a reference. Give the number of instances as 3, which produces 3 slots, and give the angle spacing between them. Click OK. Now our helical gear is created. For giving the aesthetic look, we have to give the color in a view toolbar. 
select a color based upon your requirement Click our helical gear and go to the appearances. Give the color based upon your requirement. To get the regular updates of my video, please subscribe in my channel. Don't forget to like and share. Inshallah, we will meet in next video. Thank you for watching.